was crazy, but things are finally right. Welcome back guys. Today we're going to talk about a trailer hitch. Several weeks ago, my wife and I decided we wanted to install a trailer hitch on this vehicle right here. That way, if we wanted to transport the building materials, animal feed, and other things in the future, due to our growing homestead, instead of renting a U-Haul or some other type of uh, rental vehicle, this way we can do it ourselves. So we took um, our vehicle to the Honda dealer yesterday and I'm going to show you the uh, total price of this hitch and this is what they installed. They installed the hitch and a light kit and this is how much it cost. There you go guys, I don't know if you can read this but for the trailer hitch kit we spent $385 and for the harness $382 158 dollars for labor total price came to yeah 926 ah uh, never mind total price with taxes came to 1059 i know it is a steep price but this is something that i meant to do uh, a very long time ago and when when we lived in jersey and now definitely we can put this vehicle to use in more ways than one and we're headed over to tractor supply because we are going to get a trailer there we're going to get a five by eight trailer and um i looked at some of the other places where they sell trailers and and this one had uh, the right size everything that uh, i'm looking for yeah and i can't wait to put it to you so that i believe is uh, 1200 bucks plus taxes but what we're going to do is once we get it we're going to park it we got plenty of parking space back there and that's where we're gonna leave it. The Honda dealer did not give us a ball and the reason is because there are many types of uh, ball or many different sizes. And for this particular application, we need a two inch ball and that's, uh, the balls are cheap. They're like 20 bucks a piece. And I'm gonna pick one up at uh, either Home Depot or uh, Tractor Supply when I visit. So basically, oh, and by the way, I do have to mention we've never never had a hitch before installed on any of our vehicles so this is relatively new to us i mean we've heard about them but we've never used one so we're gonna connect this here uh put the pin through and now i'm gonna secure the pin there we go it's nice and secure and once I get the ball, the two inch ball, I'm gonna slap it in there and connect the trailer to it. Yeah, my wife and I are headed to the store to pick up the new trailer here in, a, in about a minute. So before we head on over to Tractor Supply, I had to take my wife over to Kohl's. I'm here at the parking lot of Kohl's. I don't go in because I'm allergic to uh, stores, unless it's a hardware store or Tractor Supply or computer stores. I love computer stores. Remember the old CompUSA? They're gone. Yeah, but at least it's warm today. It's March 18th, Friday, and it's gonna go up to 60, I believe. Right now it's about 52, so the temperature's gonna go up. Oh, my wife is back. All right, guys, so we just bought the ball for the hitch. This is a two inch ball, three quarter inch shank. There we go. Goes in perfectly. And now I just gotta tighten it up. So I'm just gonna tighten it up a little bit and we're gonna go get that trailer. 
There we go. Perfect. All right, guys, so finally, look, we are here at Tractor Supply, and we got the hitch hooked up. Now we're gonna take it home, and uh, we have to register it with DMV here in a couple of days. So, what do you think, huh? Oh, and by the way, we saw a bunch of baby chicks inside and ducks. Beautiful. I, I was almost tempted to buy like 20 of them today. Finally, we are back home. Like I said earlier, it's a five by eight. It's really nice. I can carry a lot of stuff here now. Lots of lumber and a bunch of other things that I plan to do this this year. Actually, this will be this will be here for many many years. So, the guy at the tractor supply, he said. You, he asked this question, you guys know that you do have to register it, right? And I'm like, yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, I had no idea. So yeah, it turns out that we have a title that goes along with this trailer. Now we have to go to DMV and get it registered. And yeah, I'm very happy by the way. I'm ecstatic. I have so many plans for this over the next few years. And yeah, that, that saves us from having to buy a pickup truck and yeah we've been thinking about it for a while and i just pulled the trigger we did everything back to back without even thinking about it so yeah we i did a little bit of research and this is the right size now they also have uh six foot long uh trailers and ten, 10 foot long trailers but i believe that the eight for me it's ideal and this is a, a type two or class two uh, trailer yeah, which is all I need. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and unhook it. Yeah, the lights and everything, they do work on it. I'm gonna use this piece of wood that I intended for firewood. Well, not anymore. I'm gonna put a piece of wood on the back wheel so it doesn't roll away. So what do you think guys? Was it a good buy? It was 13, yeah, 1300 and change. The actual price was 1199 plus tax. So if you guys have ever had one of these, put it in the comments below. You know, what type, uh, what brand. Uh, like I said, this, uh, this one is from Tractor Supply. I've read a lot of reviews online and a lot of people love it. So yeah, I hope to get many years uh, of use out of it. All right guys, with that, you guys have a good morning, afternoon or night, wherever you are. Hasta mañana.